There was a dramatic rescue with a twist. Deputies and firefighters spent hours pulling a man to safety after he fell 40 feet into a well last night. Alex Ross tells us why that man will likely be going to jail once he's out of the hospital. What started as a routine call to deputies Monday night became a three-hour-long rescue mission to extract a homeless man from a well. Deputies received a call at 5.19 p.m. from property owners in the 3800 block of West McGaffey Street, just outside of Roswell. They claimed a man was inside a shed on their property that housed a well. They uh, just called and says, hey, there's a guy trespassing on the property. I guess they've seen him go inside there. When deputies arrived, they discovered a very different situation. When the deputies got there, uh, they actually observed that the guy had fallen down into the well itself. It's a, it's a large hole that it was big enough for the person to be laying there. He fell 40 feet, about three stories is what they said, down, hit the ground. Area fire departments came to the scene. Two firefighters eventually climbed down into the well with a gurney to get the 48-year-old man out. Once they uh, got him hooked up, there was no way to raise the bed out, so they put him on a gurney and use the ladder truck to raise him out of the hole. The man was airlifted to a hospital to receive treatment for his ribs and other internal injuries. Harrington said it is still not known if the man went into the well intentionally or by accident. Harrington says once the man recovers from his injuries, he will face trespassing charges. In Roswell, Alex Ross, KOB4.